once the toolkit has loaded you'll be brought to this screen the project browser this is where you will find your previously created projects and also where you can create a new project to create a new project we either press create plus or go to the new project tab create plus takes you to this tab so the name of your project cannot be empty so p4 and then the theme of the project so p4 underscore halloween heads if i was making heads for halloween and the reason i do an abbreviation of my username beforehand is just to add a level another level or less chances of conflicting with another mod as you can see if i would put a name that already exists it tells me it already exists even though both mods would actually use a different unique identifier it does this so there's less chance of conflicts and that's another reason why i add the abbreviation at the front so go put tests just this is an example because this is a tutorial project and then i would press create Is the next window that shows up once you've clicked create or even load an existing project this is the level browser i won't go into too much detail about this but just an example if creating a character creation asset i would load cc underscore i and load this if i wanted to test other things like spells or items i actually just use basic level a however you do not need to load a level until you're ready to test your mod in that case you would press cancel and then when ready to load a level so say so you've got your assets all set up we'd go to file and then load level now once your mod is finished and ready to be published go to project project settings type in the name you actually want people to see in the mod browser in mod io or in your mod manager that you use outside of the game author that would be your mod author name so like mine being padme 4000 a description random description here so once this is set up you can then publish local as you do not have to use mod io whatsoever if you do not want to publish local is the same as if we would pack our mods with islib or the modders multi-tool if we want to publish to mod io however we do need a thumbnail so like the cover of our mod this will also then show up in our project area if we assign a picture there as well